Hello everyone, I'm Son of Beast, and I'm Mephone, and this is NBA 2K22 on 2K Sports. Hey guys, Mephone here, along with Son of Beast, my man, is back, and we are ready for another matchup here of the NBA 2K22. It was fun and exciting to see uh, OJ come in. What do you think? I really like it. It's very, very, very clever. But I am also enjoyed here being on here with with the other guys as well. It's quite harder than you think. But there is more that we are going for the next matchup to see this game. Who do we got here? We have the next one for you. It's the it's the Los Angeles Lakers as LeBron James faces on against Denver Nuggets and Denver, Colorado of Nikola Jokic. Well, this game could be a very, very intense matchup here. I might find out what's going to happen now. So, what do you think will be? I think there might be a lot of hard solution in between two tricks twice as nice. And also importantly, DeAndre Jordan has is now playing with the LA Lakers and not here with Brooklyn Nets anymore because of that, the other player is already on here, like Patty Mills or something. Well, I, I have no idea because I, I wasn't able to uh, figure out if I was correct. It is not him anyway. It's quite hard. I never seen this one. Also, DeAndre Bembry keeping an eyes on him. So anyway, it's time to see what we get the next one on here as the Lakers face on against the Nuggets. Here are the lineups for the Lakers. We have is Russell Westbrook, Avery Bradley, LeBron James, Anthony Davis, and DeAndre Jordan. It's quite being honest, it's, it's quite very amazing. Everyone's expecting and complaining about LeBron James's effort, how hard they played. It should never uh, go wrong with anything like that, but that's hard. Then they have done like they did before. Yeah, I was expecting this was going to ever happen. And now for the Denver Nuggets, we have as Monty Morris, Will Barton, Aaron Gordon, Jeff Green, and Nikola Jokic. We're going to see how they could do to try to handle it up if they wanted to keep it right in their pockets. Rub your hands and keep an eyes on. So it looks like we're ready to get things on the board and let's find out what this matchup is going to take. If you've seen episode 17, 2K TV vs. The World of My Team, that might be very tough enough to get right into it. Now, let's head you over to do the Ball Arena of Denver, Colorado. Yep, that's right. Let's keep an eyes on. showdown here as we have Lakers and Nuggets. We're going to see who can take the lead first. Let's go to Ali first. Thanks, I mean, Anthony Davis is shining with the Lakers. LeBron said, quote, there's a reason we wanted him here. He's a complete player. All he ever wanted 
was a chance. And now that he has it, we haven't seen the best of Baby yet. He is just scratching the surface. Makes you excited, B.A. Thanks so much, Ali. We know that Anthony Davis is keeping an eye on a run. What do you think about here, Son of Beast? I think that's got a lot of hard epic out there. Too much epic going on here, but there might be some tough ones that could be getting it. Your key matchup is LeBron James and Aaron Gordon. A lot of my handling and coaches, Frank Vogel and Mike Malone. And we're right on then to give it a start and see what we have. As of right now, the Nuggets win the tip-off, and we are ready to play NBA. Here's Gordon on the right side. He dishes off across to Jokic. Right over to Morris. Morris goes back to Gordon. Gordon over James. Denies the shot. Goes right down and back again. LeBron James. Seems like he's getting a block things out a bit. What a great D here. Anthony Davis inside. Goes in with a layup and he takes the first bucket in the game. Anthony Davis, if you're looking for his drive, that's how hard he gets there. And not too much to try to figure this one out, but it's very hard to, uh, to find out how well he does. On the left side is Burton. He comes around, takes a shot in a quarter angle, and that will be a second two-point first pointer of the game. Will Barton seems like he's on a good run out there. Inside, James. James takes the layup here as Anthony Davis picks the assist. Morris on the other hand, covered up by Russell Westbrook. And let me tell you about Russell Westbrook. He has played with the Wizards the last time, just one season, but he's decided to not play with the Washington Wizards and go to the other team with the other guys. So he decided to say, you know what? Forget it. I am going with the other team to play with my guys that I know. So, he decided to do is to go with the Lakers. An excellent three-pointer for Will Barton. Amazing play here for the three as they hit pick up one-point lead. And you can take a look at Will Barton. His three-pointer shot turned out awesome. Russell Westbrook makes it two here as their team keeps it up by one. This is how this last game for this season turned out to be one tough lucky for our last season to this season, 2021-22. to Lost the ball and turns it over to Avery Bradley. Bradley on to the attack. James for three. And that goes in there. Open three-pointer as Avery Bradley picks up for his first assist. LeBron James, wide open corner shots. That's how tough he can. Gordon looking over, screen on green. Right around Old Davis, and he doesn't pick up a second bucket here, this one. Davis finds James. James to Westbrook. Westbrook going inside, and it's denied by Jeff Green. Jeff Green, his first block turned out healthy. Happy to help hear it. Gordon for three. He misses out the three-pointer as it turns the other way to L.A. Ball. Last season, they already won against, pick up a win against the OKC Funders as they pick up a, a shocking lead here as LeBron James answers it back, try to win it all. Yes, LeBron James, how tough can he go with? He, I cannot believe how well he has done. And trying to pick up for his game, that's hard when he has done it so far. That was amazing. Rejection is covered by Davis. But the recover of this one is Denver Nuggets. One more look of Jeff Green with the block by Mobile One. Jeff Green, he's turning out fantastic out there. Not even too much here. No foul has been given out. And they have done it a good deed. Now the first time I will be called by is Denver Nuggets as Carmelo Anthony shoves in. And their Davis goes to the center. And Jeff Green is checked out. Now they're going to make some changes out here. Not too much going. I'm seeing uh, a lot of plays out here for, for Denver Nuggets. And what's the status out there for, for Nikola Jokic and how well he had played last season with the team? These plays can definitely be honorable as I really have tried to uh, spec it up before. But not too
too much to say about uh, his angle for his shot. He was the Kia MVP last season in 2021 for the NBA Awards. That turned out to be one of his huge successful games in his career. He's turning out amazing. He's pushing the pace. He is, he is definitely on fire to make everything pay off. But I'm thinking he's going to have to try to keep this thing up again if he wins it all. After the substitution, his green, he will be taking it over from the, uh, from the other hand, and he will try to pick it up. And with no time being called as a uh, man out of bounds, that will turn it over into L.A. ball. Too much screen. I think that's what happened with the shots of this clip. Um, we do not like that one. Davis up. Makes a shot. He is has another two-pointer here on the streaking goes. Last couple games in 2019-20 and 20-21. to Campazzo. Open the line. Naji. Try to go with a rebound here to try to fix it off. Gordon. Pass back to Campazzo. Three coming for Highland. Highland misses a shot and Westbrook turns it the other way. You can't have open three-pointers in this game. If you have three-pointers, that's going to definitely be on you. And what a play! This turned out to be Aaron Gordon with a block! A first block for defenseman. Now new changes are coming in for Lakers as Russell Westbrook subs out and Roshan Rondo checking in. We expected early. He was playing here with the Clippers. But now he's with the LA Lakers because he really wanted to try to give it up. So he didn't want to try to go back to the Clippers again with Paul George and Kawhi Leonard. So he made a decision to go to return to the Lakers, but not uh, move to the number team. Highland, back out to Campazzo. Campazzo for three. That missed out really early at that point as Anthony Davis picks out the other way. Rondo to Monk. 120 left to play here in the first period as the screen doubles. And look out below, we got a dunk here for Monk. Monk is picking out his first dunk, and Mike Malone will have to call a timeout with 115 left to go. <laughs> kind of hard enough to be going out here, but that's very hard. And you can see Rocky, that's a mascot right over there for the Denver Nuggets. It's very hard to try to pick things up. I really have never seen this one play before. It may be hard to try to go right around it. After the change is being called, we bring it back to the RN. Here's Campazzo. He hasn't scored any buckets yet. Green and a foul goes on to Melo Anthony. His bucks. First team foul going on LA Lakers with 11 remaining. Camelo Anthony, he has played here with the Portland Trump Blazers of how well he hasn't, he hasn't really done that one quite so often. And when he has done it before, well, this is how hard he has played. Gordon, inside, denied by Davis and it goes out of bounds. And Nuggets goes the other way to try to fix it off. Steps up. Nashi doesn't able to hit that run. Davis, he's like on a roll. He's strong out there. Says, no, no, mister. I got it all. I'm going to help the team win it all and face it here to go back to the playoffs. Composo, deep three. And a miss off the target as it goes right into air ball. Anthony finding a look over here on cover on green. And Green denies the shot, and it goes up again, and it's foul on Denver. That will be Green's first personal foul. Camelo Anthony will go to the free throw line to shoot two. And let's uh, let's talk about how uh, Camelo Anthony did last season. His last season played here with the Portland Trail Blazers, as he had done a lot more better than he had. Try to pick things up a bit. But he didn't really come up to a hard, sick 
Christian out there decided that I wanted to try to avoid the team and go out to help the team make it better. We've seen the Lakers win the finals since 2020, but there might be another way that we can try to take it off to win it all. D. White Howard checked in for Anthony Davis. Number two players are coming out. Bull and Jeff Green switches over to Sutton. Makes his second free throw. It will be another two pointer here. Two point coming in for Carlo Anthony. Composa looking over. Highland outside. Highland right over to Gordon. Bounce pass to Bull. Gordon outside for three. Makes it in there. That's a three pointer for Gordon. Boyle with the assist. And they have it all down here. Charlie by Tang. With the buzz beater. It doesn't carry around as the first quarter comes to an end. 18 to 8 score run. A lot of defensive breakdowns here for Nuggets, but not for the Lakers as Anthony Davis has picked it up on the run. And that will conclude. Stick around for the second quarter coming up after this. You know, wherever I feel best suit our team. I'm a smart, cerebral basketball player. Um, my basketball IQ is very high, and I take that very seriously. So I know what best suits our team, and our coaching staff does as well. On his floor, I'm definitely going to tell that LeBron James has definitely have done a lot of good floor generations out there. He's like a best. Whoa, Carmelo Anthony going out with a dunk. That turned out to be another two pointer here for Carmelo Anthony to pick up his score. Highland up, makes a shot, and that will be his first bucket of the game. The Lakers are leading up by 10. Here's Howard. He has played here with the Sixers last season, but able to fail his conversion and try to go with a different run. Howard is back. Look at that. A dunk is turning out to be an over direction here that he has never done here before. Oh man, D. D. White Howard, he's like a fresher and a killer out there. You gotta watch out for him. He's like strong. Lost the ball, it's Horton Tucker taking it over. And he will have to try to stop the clock here with 5.04 to go as Compasso reaches his first personal, first team foul on Denver. Now Horton Tucker will check out and Reeves will check in. We're also with LeBron James. Compasso is checked out. And turning back in is Mar Markeith Morris. Winding a look is Rondo on Morris over Rondo. And that missed off the bucket here as Morris takes the rebound. Jeff Green able to take two blocks in a row. Only had reached up one foul to try to pick it off. And a steal is on Howard. Rondo finds Anthony. Anthony delivering the dunk. And it goes right around the direction. Wow, Camelo Anthony, you gotta watch your eye on him. You try to keep it on the run. You do not want to let hit this guy come down to a wiring angle out there. Highland with the three. Miss out. Very late on the carry. Rondo finding a look over it. Or Keith Boris on the cover. Up and over is James. On Barton, over Barton, makes a shot, turn around the other angle as Jays picks up another bucket. That's eight points in the game, he's on a perfect score. Highland looking over again, goes up, makes a shot, that's a second bucket for Highland, as they're up again. Their bench outscoring the Nuggets by eight for the Lakers, and they gotta try to figure it out to do it again. James, inside, oh, he ducks it across, knocks out the player, we gotta go to Antifa's 5G slam, damn, slam cam, look at that, James, pressure, and that's what you have called it for, James says, get out of my way, I am in the, in the ball, no way is catching me, that was your slam dunk presented by AT&T, a fantastic game. Now the first foul calls on LeBron James as a revenge back for the Nuggets. First foul, first team foul for the Lakers. And, and you can definitely see that the 
Will Barton was able to pick up his pressure out there. He was trying to go with the attack, but what did he just say? He says, you're really going to try to attack me? Well, no siree, you already, up. You already got into a, a hardcore. Will Barton makes the first free throw. A new change up here for the Lakers as Westbrook and Jordan check in for Rondo and Howard. Just 3.31 left. Your score right now is 28 to 13. And he makes a shot. Martin gets seven points in the game and we're playing pressure on the carry. Finds James outside on Barton to Westbrook. Westbrook, no problem with the shot as the assist comes up to James. Now the next timeout called out by Denver Nuggets with 3.23 left to go. A lot of hard symmetration out there. This is what everyone was thinking of. How hard they done. Nobody had gotten in front, but that was really hard how this played it, and it didn't really help it at all. And now new changes are coming in for a couple of them for the for the Lakers and Nuggets here. Anthony is checked out and Davis is checked in. Morris outside trying to look over it. You'll catch your three. He missed out on that one as the first three doesn't go in there. Finding a look. Davis step back and he makes a shot. Davis gets another two pointer here as James keeps the assist going. And you can't go wrong with uh, Anthony Davis. That definitely really made, made it really tricky enough to try to uh, make the bucket on this one. Finds Jokic. And a good D here for DeAndre Jordan to try to stop the carry on the run. Looking back, Davis, another bucket in there. And that's another assist by Westbrook. Westbrook got a first carried out there. Made quick eyes, quick contact, quick shot. Another bucket going in for Highland. That will be number three in the bucket. Try to look over the run. And he got to try to fix it up. Oh! Look out below! DeAndre Jordan slams it down. And Westbrook with the dunk. He's like, a, he's like a hardcore. He says, no ever mess up with DeAndre Jordan, the trainer from Brooklyn Nets to the LA Lakers. Jokic, right over the green. Shot made. Martin for three. He makes it in there. Martin trying to scan through to stop the run out there from the Lakers. And now they're coming back in there. Another shot, James, no problem out here. And it turned out to be another one for Russell Westbrook. 12 points in the game, eight points up, and another one calls it for an offensive foul. After the call an offensive foul here, it's without changing to LA ball, a, a one, a, another turnover on Denver to pick up the run. James, outside, trying to help the D out. Gordon, can't help, and he goes up with a dunking again, once more. James is like even a killer out there. You can't mess up the king. And a foul calls on Avery Bradley, his first second team foul on LA Lakers. With a minute and 10 to go in the game. And they are pushing up the pace out there. 40 to 19 is their score. This is like a hard, hard game in between Denver and LA. Yeah, I'm, I'm expecting this was going to ever happen. Because of that, they've got a good team here. They're looking for a chance to come back to the playoff spot when they really wanted to get in there. I know that was going to happen, but it never, it never did literally get there in time. Warren Ducker checking in for LeBron James. And the two players are coming in there. Jeff Green and Morris are out. Capazzo and Green are checked in. And two buckets good here for Will Barton. 
as he gets up 12 points in the game. Free throws in between the Nuggets and the Lakers. Just 100% here, nothing missed. A nice D going up by Aaron Gordon. He got a first rebound. Now we're looking here for Nanji. Finds Burton. And a foul turned out to be DeAndre Jordan. His third personal team foul on the LA Lakers. And that'll be his first personal foul. Burton, he's like struggling in there. And he really has a lot of them. He was like wide open, but covering man defensively. And DeAndre Jordan, he was just trying to like keep your eyes out of here and don't even mess up with him. That's going to be like a tough score to try to keep an eye on the run. Martin makes the first free throw with just 50.3 seconds to go in the first half. We got a good strength here. Lakers are on a smoking start of the run. We try to pick this all up. And yeah, you already know it's already Happy New Year anyway, so you already know that. He doesn't go in the second, second, so that would be one out of two. Tucker on Barton. Tucker looking over, and this will go flying inside the rim. That goes in with the first bucket for Horton Tucker. Just about 35 seconds left to go here. 42 to 22 to score. And now it turned out to be another transition here in between. Green finds Naji. Naji to Campazzo. The screen is underway. Trying to block the pass, and no siree! Jeff Green still got it! And he just made it through. Jeff Green, he's like just going up. I thought this almost turned it over, but he says, not this time, I have the ball right away. And coming in for the buzz beater, it's Bradley. Can he make it? Yes, he can! He made a three-pointer out there, and that will end the first half. Buzz beater in the other direction will be off the target. So that ends the first half. 45 to 4, 24 is your, your first half score. Well, those teams could be definitely hard on tricks. Let's send you over to Ali on his side. Ali? I'm with Coach Mike Malone. Coach Austin Cerner, you by the lack of urgency and execution in the first half. Thank you, Allie. We'll be right back with the second half. Don't go anywhere. It'll be underway soon. Let's have your look at the first half of Lakers and Nuggets. Two assists and one block. Tonight isn't an exception as looking back at his last few games, he's been stringing together some incredible performances. And let's get your thoughts, Kenny, on the Lakers. Well, when you pass the ball the way they have, you put the guy in the corner. The guy's in total sync. And the difference is the ball movement. I mean, they're moving the ball around and it's striking. And, big fellow, let's get your thoughts on the Nuggets. The first half stockings are in. Here are the scores and some statistics. Trying to put a stop to it, but nope. Just keep giving up open looks, letting the league get bigger. Thanks for joining us, and we'll be right back with you for the post game. And that'll do it for us. And thanks for joining the halftime. Let's send you back over to Ball Arena. Me phone? We'd like to all welcome you back here at the Ball Arena. And we're also always here before, the player that we are all looking for is LeBron James, the King James. King James is like a, a very fantastic player to be here. I know he was like pulling the pressure out there, but he has made a great block. What a play he had done. And also in Space Jam 2, the new legacy. It's turning out great, fantastic out there with Russell Crew with Anthony Davis. And with Damian Lillard here too. It's awesome, right? I know. I really enjoyed this movie. I think most people are really liking Michael Jordan, the first one better, but uh, if you have anything to go for, what's your favorite going to be? I would ex I would expect if um, I would say the first one. It's not that bad. It was amazing how this all turned out. Not too much here, but not, not too much in the over there. I really like it, though. The first one with Michael Jordan, it was impressive. I like the one with James here too, but I do not like to do it at, on the uh, Goon Squad. I like being in the Toon Squad, that's all I can hear. 
Yeah, I agree. I totally agree with you. You're definitely on the good side. On the lane. Not on the bad side. So Anthony Davis has made two shots with and one. And Will Burton has freaked up his first. Another team foul going on on Denver Nuggets. He makes one in. That turns out to be 48 to 24 score. Now Morse. He goes over to Green. Morris, try to answer it back right along the way. Screen, not able to pick it up anyway. Jokic up, makes the shot. That will be his first bucket here in the game. And Nikola Jokic, he has gotten the first one in there. Got it. it turned out to be amazing, amazing shots out here. Turned out to be better. James, up with the shot. He goes off, and that rebound puts up Jokic. Right over there is Gordon. Trying to fade it, and not too long. Eric Gordon has picked up another two-pointer. He's got a first two-pointer in the game. Nice play here for Aaron Gordon. He's got a good one here. Oh, Westbrook slams it down. We're going to go back to that one. Wow. Look at that play. He's up smoking. He says, James, this is for you. Look at that. That was a Sarai Lamb dunk presented by AT&T 5G. What a play here. That's awesome. I like that one the better. I don't know which was the comparison here, but that's turned out to be more better than I expected. Three-pointer no good for Aaron Gordon. Now going in the other one. Now you. It goes in for DeAndre Jordan. And Russell Westbrook pick up the assist. No problem here. Looking over is Jokic. Finding another angle is Morris. Morris back to bargain and goes right around it, scoops it in there, and he makes a drive. Now the first timeout falls out is LA Lakers with just 3 spurt 56 to go. Looking better in strong, comfortable pace out there, but there might be another solution where we can get to that point. And guys, let's talk about this. But for Keith Morris and, and the other guys, uh, real, Monte Morris is putting up a lot of a good plays in this one. He really has to find himself without Jamal Murray being here. And because of uh, his uh, restrictions going on in uh, COVID-19, this is what definitely would happen, how that turned out to be one of his games that got him into a rough simulation and maybe too hard for him to try to carry it on. That's going to be very tough for him to try to pick up on a run, and it's going to be too much to try to figure it in. New changes are coming in for the Lakers and the Nuggets. We have Camelo Anthony checking in for Anthony Davis, and James is still in the game with Monk, Rondo, and Howard. On the other hand, it turned out to be the other hand, Monk! And a point in the corner for free. And James making the assist. Has only one change here for Nuggets. Looking, oh wow, what a great pass by Jokic. That will be his first assist in this game. Will Barton gets another one. That's 17 points. Anthony trying to look over down the Savane D. Rondo. And Anthony going inside. And it's knocked away by Jeff Green. I mean, Boyle, I meant. Boyle, right to Barton. Boyle finds Morris. Looks over, is Jokic. Looks over, is Gordon. Five to shoot. And a shot off the angle. It hits the backboard. Mock for three. Another angle is no good for LA Lakers as it turns out to be another ball. Nuggets are still trying to trail it back in there to try to find the answer. And oh, he messes up on James. Trying to go with a, with a shot, but he gets off an angle. And Will Barton delivers another one. That's what first assist in this game. What a play. I know that one. And oh, wow. Wow, D. Wright Howard, you gotta look out for him. 
Yeah, and I, and I agree on that one, Will. Well, D.Y. Howard, he's like, oh, like an all alone guy, not to assume him again. And a dunk going back again on James with the assist. And, and with that dunk, I have no idea who could that be. We have under two minutes to go here for this one. Jokic finding inside. Barton outside. Jokic for three. Turns out early shot as no good turned out to be Jokic on a three-point run. He only has two. He is slowing down, not picking up speed. And we got a good D here on Jokic and the other guys. Looking back over is Barton. Barton up. Tries again. That's 19 points for Barton. And he's uh, smoking. Smoking badly. Breaking bad, or, or even tough, of course, like uh, like turning bad into good. Oh, the alley oop again! That's on D.Y. Howard. He's like slamming all over the place. I can't believe it. Now the next timeout is going by Denver Nuggets with a minute and seven to go. We gotta like take a quick break out there. We're going too crazy out here. Gotta go right around it. And now new changes are coming in here as we have a little, uh, little, uh, almost, almost about a minute to go here. Three players are checked out. Davis, Horton Tucker, and Monk. And finding a look at the angle. Good D on LeBron James. Green, Angie Highland, and Composite are checked in. Green on James. Takes a shot. Air ball goes. Has another miss here for LA Lakers and turning it back is Highland. Finds Nachi. And oh, what a D here for Anthony Davis to stop the, the attacker. And he says, no, no siree, no question to go for. I have the ball. It's going to be on Goon Squad. And Gordon runs out of bounds. There's no shot called. We're making it in, and the block going over is Anthony Davis. Anthony Davis is like a like a hard killer out there. You never mess with this guy up, but he telling him to he telling the Yukla Jokic that you're on the goon squad. I don't even understand how this turned out. Like a like a bro. Jeez, that's like a hard thing I just never saw. It. Only 20 seconds left here. 61 to 36 to go. Uh, it's your score, I meant. So sorry. Westbrook try to look around the floor. He goes up. Shot, no good. Highland try to look over and again. Five seconds to shoot. Compazzo try to rip it, and a jump ball is called on Compazzo and Westbrook. That's going to be right in between those those two. And let's see who is going to take the take the risk of it. It will be Lakers, and they will end it off on the third quarter. 61 to 36 is your score. The final quarter is underway next after this one. Don't go anywhere. It will be the last one to take it from here before the game has end. Before we close this off, let's have a look at the State Farm Assistant the game and turning out to be Lakers. How did this happen? Well, there's one. That's what happened when D.Y. Howard was slamming it. And there was the assist that turned out to be Rajon Rondo's score after playing with the Clippers season. And now we are all ready to round up for the fourth quarter. One more to go, and we are all done. I proclaim here, we're all done. And after this game is over, I think we're all going to be really excited for the next one. So, so Nina just got a first bucket here. Well done for the play. Now here's Reeves. Davis trying to pick up a screen, but he does not. Green trying to steal it. And a turnaround here. Horton Tucker saving it. Reeves still has the ball. And taking a steal again. And Davis still has it. Bradley for his three. Makes it in there. Another three-pointer for the Lakers. And Davis keeps it rolling. And Davis still has, still saw the ball coming out there. He still has it. Can't call. Finding Green. 
three. Concaso for three. Doesn't have the board here. He is off and missed away. And look at this play. Oh, DeAndre Jordan lost a dunk. He couldn't fix it. Green, back inside. Goes right in there and a foul called on Avery Bradley. His second first team foul on LA Lakers. It looks like uh, looks like Jeff Green will have to go back to the free throw line to shoot two. He's like all over the place. Not picking up the right moment out there. That's very going to be hard fear for the for the Denver Nuggets to try to pick it up and try to make it one in. It's the first free throw. And for Jeff Green, he is able to be played with the Brooklyn Nets, but decided that he is not able to return here at the moment. It was very hard to try to uh, configure how he had done, but that won't be happening till then. And Jeff Green hits two free throws. That will be four buckets in a row, and it will be 64 to 40. Reeves on Highland. Reeves trying to look forward here and a blocked alley oop is on Ninaji. Green in the drive inside, making a number two pointer here. Look easy. A lot of lot of scoring breakdowns here for off for deep for offense on the Lakers. That turned out to be just very tough. I was never expected to see that coming. Free for Reeves. Able to answer it through as he gets a first three-pointer here in this one. Compazzo trying to fight, fight, fight it off. And now the reach is called on Horton Tucker, his first second team foul. On LA Lakers, Davis is checked out as Jordan Ellington's checked in and D. Wyatt Howard's back in the game. New change over here, we have Jeff Green, two of them. Not sure where they where they come from. Composo finding Gordon. Gordon up. A reverse drive and he makes it number two point save throw. That's seven points for Aaron Gordon. And now just only 547 to go. Ellington outside. Hasn't able to pick up this run. He never got a chance to do it. Screen. Reeves for three. Doesn't hit that pointer as it goes around the other way. 3 30 left to go. Gordon finds Capazzo. No score for him. Oh, knocks it out of here, and he makes the drive. He's finally got a bucket here for Capazzo. And they're trying to pick it back in there. Composo, he's all alone already. We got no points. He has just got it. And that calls an offensive foul on the Lakers. It will be a LA turnover. New change up here. Camilo Anthony, DeAndre Jordan still in there. LeBron James is back in again. New change up. Morris, Barton, and Jokic are checked in for all starting five. Jeff Green finds Gordon. Jokic trying to look for, for the carry in and turn to be out of bounds and no shot here. Another turnover on Denver Nuggets would have gotten the fight. We're under three minutes here to go here as it's turned out to be a 67-46 game. Finds Westbrook, Morris on. Anthony against Jokic, over Jokic. Another miss by LA Lakers. And a lot of balls here just turned out to try to go over another run to attack it. Gordon outside, able to take it from that never angle. But Gordon still keeping it going. Got nine points in the game. Westbrook finding on Morris. And trying to go back in the, in the pointer. Looks over as James. 
Bradley on Barkhead. Anthony on Gordon. Trying to face off, and the foul has turned out to be a Denver. It will be Aaron Gordon, his first foul. And had a bad timing with the reach. That's not what's going to happen here. You're going to have to definitely watch it carefully and don't even try to uh, attack it if he's going to have to try it to face it up here again. Jordan over green, and that's another miss here for the Lakers. We're under two minutes to go here. Green, and going up green, Barton able to drill it across. Timeout called by LA Lakers with 1.51 to go. And it looks like they are trying to cut it back in the game out there. It's not going to be that easy. I don't know what to say about that. It looks like that's all it turned out. But we cannot let this happen again to be another, another turnover here for, the, for Denver. As they already had eight turnovers and four turnovers on the Lakers. And then a couple, three blocks for those two teams looking really well. I'm pretty sure they do it how they turned out. But there's, but there's nothing that they could not really keep an eyes on. They got to be trying to keep it going as long as they can get. They got to keep it trying. It's very hard. Not really, not really too much to keep an eyes on again. Too much to go for. And now let's present the New Balance player of the game. This one goes out to King James. And King James, he really has that mark. I think what he has all done, he's a star. He's a legendary player, and he had really done it before without uh, without the player of Car Catanius Cardwell Pope, and sometimes other, they don't need him, without uh, Paiute Gasol, I mean Mark Gasol, or some other guys. Westbrook on Morris. Open three for Westbrook. And he doesn't connect as Jokic goes back the other way. Martin, up again, slams it, dunk! Goes right inside of them. Martin is keeping an eyes on the pressure. Monte Morris trying to pick up the assist. Martin gets 24 points. Morris trying to look for himself. Holding the ball on him. Brook, up again. Number two miss. And they're going to try to keep this up on the line. Barton outside. Jokic going in. And he gets another two pointer. Jokic got four points in the game. Westbrook on Morris. 108 to go. Westbrook up. And that's another rebound by Barton. Another miss goes up to LA Lakers. Morris to Gordon. Looks over. Morris. Free for Barton. Answers back. A three-pointer turning out to be another direction. They're trying to keep it up. And a good assist by here from Jokic. They got it all. Backcourt violation turned out to be Denver Nuggets ball. Another turnover by LA Lakers. And now the whole team is making some changes here. Rondo, Ellington, Baines, Moore, and Howard are checked in. Any other players coming back in the other red lane? Canbar, Cornell, Boyle, and Rivers. Looking over, we got the first bucket here for Austin Rivers. They're down by seven. Try to keep it alive. Rondo finds Howard. Canbar on base, Moore. And this goes up. The bucket is no good. Morin over to Kankar. Boyle going to take the three. First three. What a play. And they're going down by four. Timeout for the last call on the Lakers. I thought this was going to be over. Wow. And you can't believe they are not giving up already. This is just insane how this one turned out. I can't believe that they are still alive, going to man pressure and pressure again and again. Wow. I don't believe that. That was just incredible. 
14.1 seconds to go here. They're trying to pick it up to attack it. And now this calls a foul called on Monte Morris, his first personal. One more foul to give. And now the foul is bringing up on Highland, his second per team foul. This will go for two free throws coming in for Russell Westbrook. That's a lot of hard scrimmage out there. Isn't that correct? I think that was totally correct, but the, but the comparison between the Western Conference teams, it was Lakers that pulled it out with a big, stoppable run at the playthrough. I have not seen Russell Westbrook playing with the Lakers, and as he often he played with the Wizards, this all turned out to be very tough. I have never have seen this play before. That was like a well, like a worse scrimmage for, for this for the Wizards, but the new day has just begun. Tough to go. As the next timeout calls out to be another play out there. This will now be um, another one to carry it on. They're all making a new change up here to try to face it off to attack it. Across inside. Another one green for three. That's in now. They're trying to go alive again. But this is winding up to be low and short on the carry. Now the foul turns out to be Aaron Gordon, his second personal foul with 5.2 seconds to go. Looking to, looking to tie it off. James gets two free throws at the line. Makes the first one. And for season four, this was happened here after the Jazz beats against Denver Nuggets with an unbeatable score. No, Denver Nuggets beat the Jazz. It was like a tough score how this turned out. And last season, they lost against the 76ers. How this all turned out was just how tough it could be. Very hard, very scrimmageable on this run. It was unbreakable. As the last time out occurs to be on Denver Nuggets, they're going to have to try to finish the attack on run to finish the layup and this drive. So that's going to be all for it. And both teams have no timeouts remaining. Next game, we will see the uh, we'll see the. Houston Rockets facing on against Orlando Magic. And then we will be seeing the Bulls facing against the Toronto Raptors at Toronto as we will be keeping in coverage here with the score. Then they will have to try to pick this in. Not, not too much here, not too much there. So that's it for those two teams. I think that's going to be very hard. Morris. Trying to make a shot, and the game is over. The final score is Lakers win, 71 to 66. That's going to be a very tough score. What a tough Western Conference matchup it turned out, and that will be hard breakable with the game. Well, they congratulate already. Now let's send you over to Allie for the finishing game. Allie. Was that why your offense was blowing? Yeah, it definitely was. But we, you know, we have to get stops in order to get the ball on the other end, and that's what we're going to do. All right, Ali, thank you very much here, and thank you all for watching of the NBA 2K22's matchup of the Western Conference matchups of Lakers and Nuggets. We now would like to present to you the three stars of the game, three players of the game, as this one will be turned out to be a best play on the court. Starting off with number three, we have as Will Barton bringing out 27 points, 
three rebounds and three assists in this game. He only had one dunk out there, only one foul to give. But not that long, it wasn't that enough to give him. Now let's head you over to number two. Zona Beast, what do you have here for the next one? Um, so for this one, this is like a tough one of the uh, examples that I have just seen playing before. At number two spot, that was our Anthony Davis. An amazing, astonishing two blocks, seven rebounds, and just 11 points. It didn't really exist that way, but that was just how hard it gets. Too much to uh, figure. And it really didn't stump me, brought Matt Banner by that one. And it turned out to be very hard how it turned out. And now for you, Phone, your number one take. Number one for the New Balance player of the game, the King James of LeBron. LeBron James, astonishing at this run, only one block, five assists, two dunks, crazy score. I have never seen this play before. How about you? Well, I, I think I've seen that play, and it's just real, that's how this turned out. Wow. Like, a, like an incredible score out there. I really like what his man is up to. Anyway, thank you for watching for this game of, of the moment of NBA 2K22. We'll see you all next game of Rockets and Magic. And we'll be back here with uh, another scoring run on each team's. With that being said, peace out to everyone for as a while as the NBA 2K22 dial. And if you're all catching out the Anime Insanity Invitational and the Exit Interview, then it will be underway next week on Episode 7. And if you have already watched the Exit Interview of Tea Kettle, check that out in the calling card up there in the corner. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you all next time. See you next time along with me and Son of Beasts.